Here's a brand new Canva tutorial that you're gonna love and today we're gonna learn how to make text pop in a busy background like this. So let me show you how to recreate this design. So first things first, go ahead and open Canva and click on custom size and choose 1080 by 1080 pixels. This will open a brand new canvas like this on Canva. So now bring in your photo. I'm gonna go with this image and now right click set image as the background. And if you wanna regenerate an image like this, I used AI and this is my exact prompt. Okay, now we're gonna bring in a logo to this design. I think the Lion King logo will look really cool and this is just an example guys. So now what I want to show you is that you can see that it looks lost in the busy background. So let's see how we can make this pop. So click on edit image and then under effects click shadow and now click drop shadow and you can see it will add a subtle shadow to the logo but if you want to increase the intensity of the shadow you can do it right here now the logo looks a little bit better but it's still getting lost in the background so let's fix that go to elements and then choose a square element i'm gonna go with this square element and this is available both on the pro and the free version now we're gonna drag it to make it a rectangle now move it down. I want this to be at the bottom because I want this to be used as a gradient to make that text pop. So let's learn how to do that. Click color. Now add new color. So click on the plus sign. And now use the color picker to choose a color from the image. I'm going to choose this darker color so it blends into the image. And now what we're going to do is we're going to click on gradient. And then you're going to copy that color code. Now click on the second color and what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and paste that color code. Next, we're going to decrease that transparency all the way to zero. So drag it all the way down. And next, under gradient style, we're going to choose a linear gradient. Now you can see you created this really nice gradient. So now let's go ahead and turn it around. I want the darker color to be at the bottom like this. Now let's bring that to the bottom layer. So how to do that is you're going to click on position and then a layer. Now bring the gradient to the second layer. Just drag it and then drop it like this. So you should have it in this order, logo, gradient, image. And that is it. This is the final result. You can see how the logo now pops more and does not get lost in the background. I hope this was helpful. And if you wanna learn Canva 10X faster to grow your business online, I highly recommend you check out my 100 Canva hacks. So make sure to go grab that whenever you're ready. It's available at the top of my profile.